I ain't interested in sharing my fire with you. Get lost already. Go on and get the hell out of here. It's all good. Calm down. Darn fool. You're gonna be a mess to clean up. All right, simmer down. Yep.
Wanna try me again? See if you do any better this time? I'm feeling good today, Way. What do you say about upping the ante this time? Make it interesting. Why not? I'm feeling good too. Ha! Okay, my friend, let's do it. Just like the last time, okay? Who can shoot the most bottles? Hey, you can't compete on a horse, cowboy. Should we get this going or what? Come on, man, let's get shooting. You know what? You take it too long. Forget it. Gotta say, for you. that was some fine shooting. Gracias, cowboy. Gotta say, that was some fine shooting. Gracias, cowboy. Gotta say, that was some fine shooting. Gracias, cowboy. Gotta say, that was some fine shooting. Gracias, cowboy. Gotta say, that was some fine shooting. Gracias, cowboy. Yeah. Gotta say, that was some fine shooting. Yeah.
There we go. How many? A lot. Uniforms everywhere. You see Sean? No. I don't think so. Damn it. Where's Trelawney? Who knows? Just hey. keep your eyes open. <clears throat> Where is that little Irish bastard? I'm not quite sure. Trelawney's off trying to find out. Has anyone been in the Blackwater to see how things lie? Place is crawling with Pinkertons, bounty hunters, and ah. pictures of Dutch and Hosea. Uh. Oh, you got a lot of money sitting in that town. And that's where it's gonna remain for now. Why haven't they hanged Sean, I wonder? I think he's bait. Well, they wanna trial him publicly. Gentlemen, Sean is being moved up the upper Montana, then to a federal prison out west. Damn. Well, we can't be rescuing people from some federal prison. We either rescue him now or cut him loose. We're not cutting anyone loose. Of course not. Ike Skeldings, boys. I'm moving him to a camp nearby before handing him over to the government. So, I guess... We need to stop them before they get to camp. Charles, why don't you head up on the north side? And then we'll head up on the other side of the valley and meet you. That way we have them in either direction. Javier, Josiah, come on. Let's go see. You know, Arthur, the government, or people whom the government like, seem to be very angry. Sure. Well, we'll rescue Sean, and then we'll get ourselves lost, good and proper. It's a big country. I hope so. All right, girl. Follow me. Let's see if we can track down this boat. Keep your eyes open for Pinkertons. They got patrols out all over this area. Yep. South of the river, West Elizabeth isn't a very welcoming place right now. It's definitely as bad as we feared in there, Arthur. I keep hearing about this woman, Heidi McCourt. There, look. I think that's our boat. All right, gentlemen. Follow me. We'll follow them. Nice and easy. Let's make sure it's him first before you go starting another war. You think they can see us? Why did you stop? If they can, we're just three fellas out on the trail. Act natural. We'll be fine. So... You've been gone for a while. Much as I love dodging the law and sleeping in the dirt with you derelicts, I do have other business to attend to. What happened in New York? You know how life is. Never a straight road anywhere. Especially with you. Nice to know I missed, though. Have you run out of people to rob? Oh, we'll never run out of people to rob. Let's go. Stay with them. You all right, Javier? Quiet. He hasn't stopped talking since we left you in Valentine. It's the longest ride of my life. Cute, dear boy. Very cute. Pick up the pace a bit. Apparently, there's a camp somewhere around here where the bounty hunters meet and transfer before continuing out west. I imagine that's where they're headed.
they've stopped. Get your binoculars out. Let's see what we're dealing with here. So who are these bounty hunters? I don't know too much about Ike Skelton's boys, but I hear they're a big crew and wild. Built some reputation in the last year or two. That looks like Sean to me. Certainly kicking up enough of a fuss. Yep, that's definitely Sean. Oh, they're giving him a decent kicking. Well, you can only imagine the shit he's been giving them. Oh, yes. They're taking him up the canyon. There's Charles on the other side. Let's go. What about the other two down there? I've got an idea. Follow me. Quietly. If we can, leave it to me, gentlemen. I'll go around and create a distraction. Then you two sneak across and do the dirty on them. Okay. Get your knife ready. Keep your head down. Wait. Let's get in the river. Wait until he's got them off guard before crossing. Wait here. He's still reeling them in. Gentlemen! Excuse me. Dear brothers, my wife is taken ill. Gravely ill. What's the problem? It's dear Bessie. You take She's the one on the left. Let's go now. Keep down. I, I'm beside myself. I, if I lose... If I lose Bessie, I lose everything! Oh, calm down, mister. I, I can't! I can't! I, I'm having a fit! God damn it, Arthur! Come on, let's get up there. A pleasure, as always, gentlemen. I think you have it from here. Come on. We got two halfway up the canyon to deal with. Okay, lean roll those boots you got there, eh? Those are very nice. Who's the guy you got them from? Is he alive still? Come on, focus. Oh. Come on! We need to get past these sons of bitches! Who the hell are they?
that far. The camp's up this way. Come on. Charles, you take the right. I'll go left. Okay. Take him down. Goddamn army of this man. How much is Charles bound? Still time. Arthur? Hurry up, fellas! Are you going to get me down from here? Arthur! <laughs> you know, you're a lot less ugly from that other angle, Arthur. Come on. <laughs> Get a hug, Arthur. A warm embrace for a lost brother now found. <laughs> you know, nothing means more to me than this gang. The bond we share. It's the most real thing to me. I would kill for it. I would happily die for it. But in spite of all of that, I would have easily left you here to rot if Charles hadn't stopped me. <laughs> I don't believe a word of that, Arthur. Get him out of here. You're a great man, Arthur Morgan. The kind of young whippersnapper can really admire. Oh, shut up. Right, we should split up. Javier, will you escort Mr. McGuire back to camp? Charles, best you ride separately. Be careful. There's patrols everywhere. What about you? I'm gonna see what's worth taking here. I'll meet you back there as soon as I can. All right. Okay, come on. <clears throat> Have I got stories for you? Yeah, I can't wait. <clears throat> I imagine y'all missed me a lot, <gasps> but fear not. The joy's back in your lives now. Okay then, girl.
still here, so thanks to you. There gonna be another problem? Okay, let's take a look at it. Sure. Pleasure doing business with you. Come on, girl. You done good, girl. Thank you.
Go on. Try and take me out again. See where it gets you. Ah, it's you. Hello, mister. Yep. Split a man's skull like it was a nut. So old Bob Crawford was livid about... You like are a business. good cousin by marriage, Seamus. Oh, I try. Now, anyway, I trust this ain't just a social call. Got a little kick show in mind, huh? Thanks, mister. Ah, you good, girl?
Just wait a second, girl.
listen. I just wanted to say, I know you bastards missed me. <laughs> Mr. Even Blair. you, Arthur. Even you. Here we go. But, no I'm back home now. Oh, so everything's Daddy, going to be okay. Uncle Sean is back. And don't you worry, Miss Grimshaw, you old crone. I'll keep them girls in line. If I have to whip them, I will. And don't you worry, Mr. Pearson, you drunk old shitbag. It'll be nothing but the, the finest game in the pot. Now, Deadly Maguire's back. <laughs> and don't worry about nothing, Mrs. Grimshaw. We'll have this camp running like clockwork. I love you, bastards. <laughs> have fun. Have we lots of fun. <laughs> Even you, you grumpy old bastard, Arthur. Oh, come on, let's enjoy it. Uh oh, ourselves. here comes trouble. I can't get rid of you, can I? Mind if I join you, fine folk? I suppose. You're looking lovely as ever, if I may say so. Imagine riding with him all the way from Blackwater to here. This stupid old I haven't received anything from you in a while, Mr. Morgan. Yeah, I will. Good. We really needed this. How's it going? Thank you, Arthur. Hello, Tilly. Oh, dear. This is gonna be a long day. Arthur, don't forget, I'm more than happy to craft Are you something doing? if you bring me the right materials. Appreciate it, Pearson. Mr. Morgan, bring me some materials, and I'll be glad to make something nice for you. I'll keep my eye out for some good material. That's all I got for you. 
Good job, Mr. Morgan. Oh, what kind of lunatic bumps that up? <laughs> That's an Honestly. interesting way of seeing things. Maybe we'll head over there one of these days, huh? Yeah. Start a new life as kangaroo farmers. Well, there's a dream we ain't had yet. Pass out. <laughs> 